Blue skies means fun days. Helping skydivers with tips and techniques about safety, training and fun jumping from those who know. Welcome to this episode of Blue Skies Fun Days. A while back, a colleague asked me if he could see how I uh, do fabric tests. And I thought this, this could make a, a quick little episode which could help people understand the processes and just how strong things are. When I'm doing fabric tests, and we'll just do it on a, an old sample piece of fabric, I have the two clamps, I have a ruler, I have a template, and a set of scales capable of measuring the 30 pounds uh, for the required three seconds as per the manual. And I have a pen for marking the fabric. Some people don't want to mark the fabric. Some manufacturers require the marking of the fabric, but I'll leave that to you when you do your tests. Anyway, the way we do it is I use the, the little template to mark where the clamps will be placed and the most important thing is that the marks be put in alignment with the weave of the fabric. With F111 or ZP fabric this is pretty easy because we have these reinforcing lines woven into the fabric. So align your template and mark it as required. The distance between the two marks is meant to be three inches or 75 millimeters. We then attach one clamp to one side, folding the fabric underneath so that the clamp can get a, a good hold. And then on the other side, we attach the other clamp, which is going to have the scales attached to it. Once again, folding the fabric back and closing the clamp on the fabric. We then attach the scales and take it up to 30 pounds for three seconds. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000. Having done this test, we then mark the canopy as required, showing when the test was done, what the test was and signing it off. The level of detail will depend on uh, whoever it is that's doing the test and what the test is for. One thing I'm sure you're all curious about is if the test is 30 pounds for three seconds, well, just how strong is this fabric? Well, let's find out. There you go. Manufacturer's specifications usually state that it should take at least 50 pounds per inch. As you can see, we well and truly exceeded that. Now you know how riggers do strength tests on fabric. In many cases with pulled threads or whatever other damage may happen, this is a key test to evaluating the serviceability of a canopy. In the meantime, have fun, fly safe, and we'll see you next time on Blue Skies Fun Days. Just a quick note to our skydiving family. Blue Skies Fun Days is here to help our family grow, have fun in the sky, and to do it safely. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, ring the bell, and tell your friends about the lessons we have on offer to help everyone become better skydivers. For more tips and techniques, Click subscribe.